are now one day into RTA's new bus service changes. It's aimed to help riders get around the city a little bit easier. Traffic reporter Susan Isaacs has the RTA bus expansion breakdown and how commuters are coping with the change. The new and improved RTA bus lines are up and running. And Delgado student Jamira Harris is taking full advantage of it. It's a relief because I don't have to get up like two hours early just to get in. Get up for the bus to be on school on time. However, 18 year old Leroy Learson begs to differ. Even when they bring on new schedules, like they're still never on time and they don't never see the best interests of people at, at home. And that's something RTA is working to improve with the new lines, which include the 106 Aurora coming from Algiers and bringing people to downtown New Orleans every 30 minutes, the return 32 Leonidas bus which brings people through the city and Treme area, and the 90 Carrollton bus, which is new and restored. It brings back the old Carrollton line and also makes direct connections to the University of New Orleans and the medical facilities on the lakefront. Another new addition are the express buses. They take riders from New Orleans East, brings them here to the Desire Parkway location. From here, buses will get on the interstate and head straight into downtown New Orleans. Changes took effect on Sunday, September 21st. Patrice Bell Mercadel works with RTA and says the goal of this project is to improve transportation options to areas needing it most. We have really focused a lot of attention on bringing some equity and access to people in some of the communities that have really been vocal about asking us for more service. In addition to this project, RTA says it will start construction on the North Rampart streetcar line at the end of the year. On your side in Gentilly, Susan Isaacs, WDSU News.